Have you ever wondered where the internet actually came from? Who invented this thing we all rely on every single day? Let's rewind the clock and take a quick journey back to where it all began. It all started in the late 1960s, during the Cold War. The U.S. military wanted a way for computers to communicate, even if parts of the network were destroyed. That idea led to a project called ARPANET, funded by the U.S. Department of Defense. In 1969, four computers in different locations, UCLA, Stanford, UC Santa Barbara, and the University of Utah were connected. And guess what? They talked to each other using a new idea called packet switching, breaking data into chunks and sending it piece by piece. That was the first version of the internet. Now, who invented it? Well, there's no single person. But two key figures stand out, Vince Cerf and Bob Kahn. In the 1970s, they developed TCP-IP, the set of rules that allows all computers to speak the same digital language. Without TCP-IAP, no modern internet. They're often called the fathers of the internet. Fast forward to the 1990s, and something big happened. British computer scientist Tim Berners-Lee created the World Wide Web in 1991. Now, people could browse websites with images, text, and links from anywhere. The internet wasn't just for scientists anymore. It became mainstream. Today, the internet connects over 5 billion people worldwide. It powers everything communication, education, entertainment, even how we work. And to think it all began with just four computers. So next time you're scrolling, streaming, or sending a message, remember the internet wasn't made by just one person. It was a team effort across decades, and it's still evolving every day.